but a Twinkie. That's what I want to know. Guy played in the NFL, and he, he's an executive vice president of Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan. He's fit as this table. You can play marbles on his stomach. Okay, <laughs> He played for the Steelers and the Chargers and the Lions, and he's with us right now. Welcome back to the program. Good morning, Michael Patrick. When was the last time you had a Twinkie? Oh, the question uh, hanging over my head this morning. Uh, it had to be uh, a dozen, 20 years ago, probably. See, so he's not going to miss Hostess. The Hostess <laughs> is going away. They had some kind no. of labor problem, so they're going to liquidate the company. And the Ho-Hos and the Ding Dongs and King Dongs and Twinkies, at least for the moment, uh, are, are history. And so they've been people, as I understand it, selling them on eBay for thousands of dollars <laughs> for people who don't want to lose the last Twinkie. The uh, ho hos and the uh, ding dongs would be more of uh, an attraction than the the uh, Twinkies, but but who's counting? Yeah, well, maybe they're going to sell the brands and someone else yeah. is going to revive them. The question is, will they be the same? I bet you they won't. Um, were the Lions ding dongs yesterday? Looks like they got to win all six of the remaining games just to have a shot at a wild card position. Yeah, their their season uh, their season is just on the uh, brink of being over from a playoff standpoint. But yesterday was just a was a weird game and sort of culminated with uh, arguments on the sideline, and uh, uh, it, it just looked like one of those things that uh, we, we gave the game away and, and uh, poor performance and lots of things you can point to, five sacks, uh, interceptions, one for a touchdown. Defense played pretty solid against a, a real strong Packer offense, but, yeah, all in all, it was, it was a frustrating, disappointing game. Uh, by the way, I see that uh, Javid Best is going to be one of your award winners uh, when you bring in, P uh, I was going to say Pete Rosell, it's not Pete <laughs> Rosell, the NFL commissioner to the Courage House dinner. Can you tell us when that is and how we could get tickets? Sure. Next uh, next Tuesday, the 27th of November at Ford Field, uh, we have our annual Detroit Lions Courage House dinner, and, and it supports the children's programs at Haven. Uh, Javid Best is going to be this year's Courage Award winner for the Detroit Lions players. Our guest speaker is... Uh, uh, now you've got to be talking. Is it Roger? Roseau. What the heck is his name? What's the NFL commissioner's name? Roger Goodell. Yes. yes. Roger Goodell. See, Thank Pete Rosell, he casts a big shadow, so how can you get tickets? You're forgetting Paul no. Tagliabue here. <laughs> I forgot about him, too. <laughs> it's it's the... DetroitLions.com and uh, able to pick up tickets for the event, uh, which is Tuesday, again, the 27th of November. That's going to be an absolute blast, and what a nice thing to do to give it to Javid Best. I will be there. See you then.